Greetings, Rocketeers! This is your Toy Commander, and are you guys ready for today's mission? Well, today's video is intended for play only. Alright guys, it's time for today's segment we call here on Planet Sizzle, Fun Facts About Outer Space with the Toy Commander. Cool. This is a really interesting fact about outer space. Now, did you know that one teaspoon of a neutron star weighs 200 billion tons? That is so crazy to think about that that little teaspoon weighs about, let's say, a rhinoceros weighs about 2,000 pounds, which is one ton. If you take 200 billion of them, that equals one teaspoon of a neutron star. Now, if you don't know what a neutron star, a neutron star used to be a, a massive star and then what happens it runs out of fuel and loses its energy so what happens is it explodes into a um, supernova so all those protons and electrons get crushed into that core and then turned into a neutron and then they're so dense and there's so much gravity that they weigh like an astronomical amount of weight on to today's video Hooray! all right it's getting close to valentine's day and all you guys out there with your sweethearts or your crush are getting ready and preparing your valentines, right? So Jurassic World Dominion has these new valentines. Now there's 16, so it includes a valentine, an envelope, and a glow stick. There's some really cool pictures, and we're also going to be doing this. So this is the new Jurassic World Mess Free Imagine Ink. That's right, no mess. Bingo. So we're going to search for hidden images. And we're going to reveal a rainbow of colors with one magic marker. Now there's games, there's puzzles, there's coloring, there's matching, there's, uh, what else? Tic-tac-toe, uh, mazes, and all kinds of fun games in here. So we'll take a look at that. And there are, right here it says, magic stickers inside. Really? So we're going to see what a magic sticker is. Now I know what a regular sticker is, but magic one we'll find out what that is too so let's head whoa oh nice there fella we got a t-rex visiting today easy buddy don't bite you know, your finger no i mean these dinosaurs think they uh run the planet oh wait a minute they used to actually yeah. can you imagine if they were still around <gasps> if they were we wouldn't be here all right guys we got so much to do why don't we head to the other table and check out these 16 valentines with envelopes and glow sticks and we'll uncover some hidden images and do some fun coloring and games let's go <laughs> Hey, what's up, T-Rex? Hey, Adonis, how's it going? Well, pretty good. Hey, it's getting close to Valentine's Day. What are you getting your sweetheart? Well, I thought about this and, uh, I don't know. I'm just, I don't, I'm running out of ideas. What about you? Well, I was gonna take her out to dinner, you know, but it's always the same old, you know, menu. You can only order certain items on Valentine's. It's usually a long wait, it's crowded, the service is usually slow, and uh, usually the food's not that good because it's always rushed and you have to hurry up because they want to rush you because it's so busy. Yeah, I understand. Uh, I'll probably just, you know, make a home-cooked meal and go pick some flowers. Great idea, I think I'll do the same. Happy Valentine's Day. Uh, yep, say hello to the missus, you too, all right. See you later, Indominus. All right, T, take care. All right, guys, here we are at the other table, and look at this. These are the 16 Valentines with glow sticks and includes envelopes and 48 heart seals. That's pretty cool, and just look at all those cool pictures on the back. Let's take a look at those. And here's our Mess Free Imagine Ink. Magic reveal, games inside, and the magic stickers. All right, this is a new one here too, so we'll take a look at that. First, let's open up this box of Valentines and see what we have inside the new Jurassic World Dominion Valentines. It's getting close, guys. It's almost Valentine's Day, and I hope you guys are preparing for your sweetheart or crush. Let's see. Whoa, all right, so. 
these are all the glow sticks. Let's take those out. They're super small, but that's okay. Obviously, we can't have those big giant glow sticks because I don't think they'll fit in the box. Nope. So there's 16 little glow sticks. I'll crack one in a few minutes and I'll show you what those look like. These are all the sticker heart seals you seal your envelope with. All right, there's a bunch of those. So these are our Valentines. Let's take a look at this first strip of Valentines. All right, so the first one says, I've got my eye on you, Valentine. Uh, and then right here it says, Valentine, you rock. Nice. All right, you are terrific, Valentine. Valentine, you are dynamite. Get it, dynamite. Valentine, friends forever? I'm a sore glad we are friends, Valentine. Get it, sore, like Dinah, sore glad. <laughs> All right, stay sharp, Valentine. Valentine, you are a friendosaurus. All right, so those are the eight, and then there's just a repeat right there. And then what you do is you, you know, take it off. So on the front, you can put from you to whoever your Valentine is. You just put your Valentine in there. You can write a little secret or special message on the back. You slip it in, and then you take one, oh, actually I forgot, you gotta put one of your glow sticks in there too. Oops. Don't forget that, cause that's cool. And then you take one of these hearts, and this is what seals the envelope, just like that. That's a cool Valentine, right there. All right guys, let's pop one of these glow sticks. There we go, I just, whoa, these are super bright. Snap it and then shake it, and these are really cool. Check those out, whoa. All right, guys, let's push our Valentines aside for now. And let's get on to our activity book. I'll just leave that there. It's just stuck on the table. Bam, here is our mess-free marker right in there. Let's pop that through the back. The serrated edge, let's pop that out. And this marker does not make a mess. Bingo. See? It will only work on this specific book. See, you can't even write on yourself with it. How cool is that? All right, wow. so let's take a look at the front. Oh, wait a minute. Oh, it broke. Uh -oh. That's okay, it'll still work. So right here is a little opening. And see, I think that's blue right there. Let's find out if that's blue poking through the front. So we have four dinos. Let's color this in and check out all these cool colors with these dinos. And that was blue right there. There she is. And it looks like we have a Parasaurolophus, a Spinosaur maybe, a T-Rex. That's the first page. Let's go on to page number two. All right, this one says, attention, animals on the road next 100 kilometers. All right, so let's color this in and find out if there are any hidden images too. All right, so it looks like we have blue, beta, pyroraptor, a dilophosaurus right there, and then these multiple different signs of attention, danger, and dinosaurs spotted here. All right, guys, so I just noticed that these two pages are stickers. These are the magic stickers. Look at that, that is so cool. Now, I did notice that the pages were a little bit thicker than usual. And so I started to peel and this is what I found. There are stickers all on these two pages. Same with this page too. You can tell because the page is a little bit thicker than these pages. So we have those two pages are stickers. And now we are starting the Magic Ink Pictures, how this book works. After playing the games on every page, try to find the icon like this one. It's hiding somewhere on each page. Cool. All right, let's color the first page and see how this book works. Whoa, look at that picture. And it says, use your Imagine Ink marker to search and reveal for hidden images. Yeah, we know. We already went over that. All right, let's go to the next page. Lead T-Rex through the maze. Follow the path that spells T-Rex.
So we found the hidden image right here. We made one mistake right here on the K. I thought it was an X. All right, so on this page, it says Carnotaurus is chasing T-Rex to start color in a square in the number scrambler. That's down below right here. Then look for that number on the game board. If it's there, color that square in. Take another turn by coloring in another square on the scrambler. Keep playing until you fill in five squares in a row on the game board. They can be horizontal, vertical, or diagonal. If you uncover three T-Rex, Carnotaurus has reached T-Rex. Don't forget your free space. You see, these are all the numbers right here, and then you see one T-Rex, one T-Rex there, and you just basically just color them in, but hopefully you don't uncover three of those T-Rex before you get five in a row. This would take a long time, so I just colored it all in quickly. And there's our hidden image right there. All right, here's a little game. Ghost was chasing a Dilophosaurus, so she changed her looks. Now, Ghost needs to find her. First color in the picture frame, then color in each Dilophosaurus until you find the one that matches. All right, so here are the four ones we need to match to that one. Here's our hidden image. It's definitely not the purple and it's definitely not the green. Now it's one of these two because they look very similar. Now number two matches the best because you can see right here this color and this color match perfectly. So let's see if it's number two. Yep, it's number two. All right, next game. So this here is kind of like an escape game. Now color in the hexagons in the box one at a time to reveal a letter. That's right down here. We have one free letter right here, it's a T. For each letter you reveal, fill in one circle below that letter. So we have to fill in one here on each one of these. When you fill in all the circles for a word, color in that square above it. That dino has escaped. Try to help each dinosaur escape before you fill in the letters, Pantera. Whoa, this could take a while, so I'm just gonna color it all in quickly. There's our hidden image right there. That would take a long time to play that game because there's a lot of letters in Therizinosaurus. All right, next game. Who is this dinosaur? Color in the frame on the bottom of the page and use the word to fill in the correct space below. The name of this dinosaur will be spelled out in the circles. So these are our five dinosaurs that we're gonna plug into this right here. We have Pantera, Stegosaurus, Giganotosaurus, Mosasaurus, and Pyroraptor. So now let's color the answer to find out it's ghost, G-H-O-S-T. And there's the hidden image right there. Next page. Color the dotted rectangle, then draw lines to connect the pictures that match. So on the next page we have tic-tac-toe, we have three games, we're going to skip over that because we have nobody to play tic-tac-toe with here, so let's oh, go to this, man. the Pyroraptor wants to catch up with Giganotosaurus to see if she missed any prey. Follow the arrows hidden in the diamonds to help guide you in the correct direction. An X means you went the wrong way, 
If you uncover an X, go back and try again. Another direction. All right, so it looks like a Pyroraptor made it to the Giganotosaurus without one X, and there's our hidden image. All right, so on this page, Blue caught up with her Raptor pack. These are the pack. But now she blends in with them. Color the pictures and spot the picture of Blue. That is different. The different one is the real Blue, and the rest are imposters. So we know that one is different and I could tell right away that this one is different and our answer is right here and it's D. All right, next page. Whoa, we got a lot to read on this one. On this page, we need to color in the square right here. If there is a number or a runner in it, you're safe. The numbers will tell you how many dilophosauruses are next to that square. They may be up, down, left, right, or even diagonal. There are six Dilophosauruses lurking in the game. Use the numbers as clues and uncover as few of them as you can to escape. Color in 10 squares to finish the game and check your score when you're done. Oh boy, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 10. We only got two. Let's see where they're all hiding. One, two, three, four, five, six. It says amazing, awesome, super, great, nice, good, well done. Let's color in this Dilophosaurus. So on this game, we're gonna be doing some dino tracking. Which dinosaurs trail are you tracking? Find out. Begin at the start and follow the arrows you reveal in the hexagons. When you find an icon, color in the icon's frame at the bottom of the page. When a box has four icon frames filled in, color it in to see what dino you've tracked down. So these are the icons right down here, and these are the hexagons we need to color. So we have one, two, three, four icons right here. The Pyro Raptor. So we also had, it is blue and it is not a baryon. This page says, warning, warning, warning. There are signs to mark dangerous areas. Color the picture and count how many of each sign you find below so we have it looks like a triceratops and then we have these signs right down here below and then let's color in this picture first there's our hidden image right there so we have one two three four five six and we have one two three and then this one, one, two, three, four, five. All right, next page, we have a maze. So in this maze, we need to help Blue and Beta. Now, they are on the move. Help them as they try to avoid T-Rex territory on their way. As you move through the maze, if you uncover one of these icons, it looks like with either beta or blue in there, then you're on the right track. Color in one of the boxes up top here. If you uncover one of those, which is the T-Rex, that's the wrong way. Color in one of those boxes. Try to finish with more of the beta blue boxes than the T-Rex boxes. All right, so on this page, 
As you make your way through the maze, try to round up the Parasaurolophuses. <laughs> when your path crosses a T-Rex, mark it below. Round up all the T-Rex and you win. This is the clue. This color sequence will help guide you. But I think we made it. Let's see what's in this corner. And there's our hidden image right there. All right, let's color in the Parasaurolophus. This is our last page. Let's color it in. I think we're running out of ink towards the end, but there is our hidden image and we, it looks like we have a T-Rex and a Giganotosaurus maybe. All right guys, that's it for today's video with our 16 Jurassic World Dominion Valentines with the glow sticks and our Mess Free Marker Imagine Ink. So many cool games and coloring. Don't forget to share this video with your friend Smash. That like button and come back to Planet Zizzle to keep the missions going. This is your Toy Commander signing off, and I'll see you guys on our next mission. It's now time for me to blast off out of here.